Talia there champs and welcome to the show. Today we're going to have a look at QNAP's awesome TS251A network attached storage. So here it is, QNAP's new 2-bay TurboNAS TS251A. This model here comes with 2GB of RAM, you can get a 4GB RAM model and it can be upgraded to 8GB of RAM. And this has some killer features and it's just raised the bar on two bay NASs. And it's white, so it's like, oh my God, I want a white NAS. So the killer feature on this is it can also be used as a DAS. So that's direct attached storage. And it can be run as both simultaneously. So what that means is I can not only connect to this via the network, which is what you would normally do with a NAS, I can also connect to it via USB. Awesome. I don't think there's any NAS, two bay NAS out there that does that sort of thing. It actually has an SD card as well. We'll get to that later. But anyway, let's just have a look. Here's the box here. So this one is able to handle 4K. It has that USB quick access, as I told you about before. Cross-platform file sharing, centralized data with disaster recovery. It's pretty much all QNAPs have. It also has cross-platform file sharing, centralized data with disaster recovery, direct PC and Mac connection via QFinder Pro and the front USB quick access port. Run multiple operating systems and apps on this NAS with remote access. Awesome. And you can actually put Windows on these as well, in virtual machines, so not just Linux, Windows too. Multi-zone multimedia control, Play videos with the bundled remote control via HDMI so you get that remote control and you'll be able to use this as a home theater PC or just a home theater device and stream all your content and use the remote control. So super simple. Sit back on your couch and just basically use it like a PVR. Also it does all the professional 24-7 surveillance solution with IP cameras. Scales up to 10 drives with the QNAP UX 800p or the UX 500p. So you can always expand your storage later on. So let's have a look at it, eh? So what do we get in the box? We have the power brick and power cord there. We have this awesome remote and all QNAPs come with this and it's actually amazing what QNAP NASAs can do. It can replace your home theater PC. So it's great to see that your NAS is not just a boring data storage unit. You have your screws, the two Cat5e cables, and here's the unit itself. We also have a quick installation guide. So here it is, and isn't it a looker? It really looks stunning, doesn't it? This beautiful white finish, it's a nice bright white. I would say it's a pure white. It's not an off-white, so beautiful. Now, my regular viewers will know I have a white Xbox, white mouse, white keyboard. I, I've got white everything, okay? And uh, my NAS is black. Unfortunately, now this thing here is just beautiful. I just love it. I mean, if I was going to buy a NAS today, it'll just yep, this is it. Why it's got to look like this because they do have a four drive version of this as well. I think they're about $510 to $550 in Australia. That's what I've seen them for. So it's not super cheap, but there is no two drive bay NAS with this many features on the market. Just none. Not being able to be used as a NAS and a DAS. Being able to connect to it via USB to your computer through this USB top 3. USB 3 connection here, I think it is. Connect that to your computer and you can access all the data files directly on your computer. So on the front here you'll see SD card slot. You have the power button there. One touch copy button, so plug your USB or SD card in, press the one touch copy button, bang, it'll just copy it down and a direct connection to this so you can connect your computer to it via the USB 3. It doesn't seem to come with a USB 3 cable, so you'll have to buy that. Open drive bays up and it's finished in a matte white too, which is like if you see glossy white 
it looks cheap and nasty. Anything glossy, anything glossy and plastic looks nasty. This is all matte except for this teal bit here, which is sort of like a metallic finish there, and it's a little glossy strip up there. So it doesn't look cheap. That's the top there. Here's the sides with the vents. And we'll have a quick look at the back here. And we have the fan there, two gigabit ethernet ports there, the power jack, two USB 3s. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see the review of this. I'm really excited about this NAS actually because as I said before, there's no two bay NAS out there that has this amount of features for this sort of price. Um, it really is a game changer having that. So that's it guys, that's my quick and dirty unboxing of the TS251A two bay turbo NAS. If you're new around here, make sure you subscribe. I've got lots more tech content coming soon. And until next time guys, tally ho.